Good morning everyone. It's Tuesday morning, nearly forgot, as you do, and yeah, pretty chill morning. This one has given me a scare. So I went downstairs to get breakfast at about half eight and I left all the doors open so she could come up and join me. And you know, I had my breakfast. She like kind of sat beside me while I had my breakfast. And then she um she kind of curled into I was like laying on my side and she was like curling into me. It was super cute, what she normally does. But her breathing suddenly got really weird. Like I don't know what it was, but like she seemed completely fine. She was in no distress whatsoever. But it's like her purring. Normally when cats purr it's like in time with their breathing, but it's like it was like really erratic purring. It was almost like a muscle spasm. And it I was it was really weird and I got really it was it doing she was doing it for like a couple minutes really badly and then it started to die down and then she kind of fell asleep and it stopped completely. But I was like I, th I thought she was shivering at first. I thought she was cold and I was like, oh god. So I like wrapped my duvet around her thinking is this gonna help? Um, I don't know it did, she fell asleep and it stopped so I'm not sure I'm not sure what it was, I asked my dad what he thinks it could be just before he left for work and he was like it could be uh, just some kind of after effect of the vaccines she had on Saturday which it could be, I mean she seems absolutely fine, she wasn't distressed it did make me really worried because like, I don't know, she's breathing fine now she seems comfy but normally if I put a blanket on her Actually, that's a lie. Sometimes she does let me do it. Usually I would say she would move because <laughs> she doesn't like it, but sometimes she does let me do it. I put my dressing gown over her like a blanket and she just sat there. I don't know. I don't know, but I'm going to keep an eye on her today to make sure she's okay. I'm sure she's fine. Today is a day of nothing, as was yesterday. Um, I don't really have any kind of productive jobs that I want to get myself sorted really i don't think i do um like yesterday i have the laundry and dishwasher and all that jazz but like i don't really have anything else chris is going to be playing squash again tonight so i think we're staying here instead of going to his house like we would normally do that's the that's the day day of nothing nothing i'm gonna put a blanket over my cat and hope that that'll keep her warm She's staring at me. <laughs> She's not sure. You're not kicking up a fuss, are you? Such a good girl. She's so sleepy, look at her. She's trying to keep her eyes open. No. Hey, beautiful girl. <laughs> oh, bless her. I just got caught by the Jehovah's Witnesses. God dang it. Not literally. God, I'm not, I don't believe. <laughs> oh, I only learned a couple of years ago that there is like a Jehovah's cult, Jehovah's cult, Jehovah's Witness, like, group in Guildford. Like, I was watching a documentary on cults, as you do, and I, in the documentary, it was like, yeah, I lived in Guildford, but there's like a really big base for Jehovah's Witnesses, and I was like, where? That's the first time in years they've come door to door so I wasn't even slightly expecting it they haven't done that I think the last time they did that must have been about six or seven years ago that I've seen them come around and yeah we had like a good five minute discussion on God and all that and I'm I'm one of those people who's too rude to slam the door in their face so I did just kind of let them preach to me about God and at first I was kind of like maybe they are just from the local church and they're just being nice and then she gave me the leaflet which is jehovahswitness.org um so yeah yeah she gave me her number as well if i wanted to call and have a chat don't get me wrong she seemed very sweet but jehovah's witness is a cult and i'm not that interested in joining thanks but that was uh god they haven't come around in ages they really haven't like we used to, because they are local apparently didn't know this but they used to come around quite frequently and it's funny because one of the two women that were there i think i recognized her from like one of the last times she came it's really bad anyways 
They seemed lovely as they were, but you know, I have no interest in becoming a Jehovah's Witness. Please and thank you. I'm probably the only person who opened the goddamn door to them today. <laughs> God dang it. Anyways, I mean, she approached it very well. She was like, with all the crap going on in the world right now, do you believe in a god? And I was like, well, clearly not, no. <laughs> it was an interesting discussion from someone who clearly doesn't believe in God, but someone who does. But uh, then she gave me the leaflet and I got scared. So that's, that's it. I thought it was the post, because I'm expecting like four different packages that are coming like within the next couple of weeks. And like, I don't know. I was like, maybe, just maybe it might be one of those, but no. I get cult leaders instead. And where were you? Miss? I was really hoping at one point you would like run down the stairs and like into another room and I'd have to be like, oh God, sorry, and slam the door in them so I can go fetch you for whatever. But no, you're having a nap up here, aren't you? Hmm. Little thing. I haven't actually vlogged that much today. Oh wow. Really dark. Let me turn the lamp on. Jesus. Whenever, like, before I start recording, the lighting's fine. Ugh. And then I start recording and the lighting changes. Anyways, I haven't vlogged, like, all day. Uh, mainly because I didn't really do anything. I did a little bit of writing. I watched a little bit of Game of Thrones, which, you know, I had to stop doing when I started my summer job because I just didn't have time anymore, so that was nice. I cuddled my cat, like, all afternoon. She's just gone back downstairs. But I've actually done nothing. I've just been sitting here. And Chris is playing squash with his brother tonight, so he's not going to be back till 10, which means normally we go to his house on Tuesday nights, but because he's coming back so late tonight, we're sleeping here instead. I think we're deciding we're going to go to his house tomorrow night to take place for tonight because otherwise we just haven't been to his house in a really long time. We try and like, our living arrangement's kind of complicated, we try and basically share our time between our families because we both still live at home. We both want to move out but we're saving, um, so while we're living at home we like to kind of spend an equal amount of time with our families, you know, while we can. Not that, you know, they're going anywhere but like, soon we'll be moving out and so uh, you know what I mean. Nothing's really happening. None of my parcels have arrived. I've been told that like three of them have been dispatched. <sighs> I don't know when they're coming, but there's... I meant to get like two this week, one the week after, and then like one in mid-October I think it said it was going to come in the end, which I was not happy about, but it was like the least important one, so it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I am... it's nearly half seven. I'm going to grab dinner. It's just gonna be a ready meal for me. I need, I need to find something to watch. This is the thing about being home all day every day is that for me, my like main thing I watch is YouTube. But like on a day where I don't get many uploads, I'm just sat there refreshing the page and nothing's coming up and I have to watch like, I have to dig up old videos that I find entertaining and it's just like, oh, but I've already watched this and then I don't really like watching Game of Thrones with dinner because it can get a bit gross, you know? I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna go get food now. Right, I'm gonna end the vlog here because I want to edit and Chris won't be back for ages so there's no point in waiting for him. Currently 8.30, he's not going to be back until like between 10 and 10.30. So I'm just going to be chilling by myself like I have been all day. This is what this week is guys, it's just chilling and doing nothing. So yeah, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!